Prime Minister has certainly got people talking, thinking, debating. Sir, in a way that I've never seen before is it true after the Queen's speech, my dad's going back to Eaton's will, and you think I'm going with him? Yes, no, I know you think this is something we haven't discussed. We haven't. Yeah, but Tiddler, me and your mum have. Told you. We don't think it's such a good idea. Not fair. Possibly not. But I'm afraid that's what we decided. Bad luck. Shut up. I'm sorry. We'll all see each other at the weekend. Bitch. Pardon? Hey. You won't be here now without me. And how do you work that out? I helped you. The only school round here that we could send you to is Westminster. It's a public school. I can't be seen to be pulling you out of a perfectly good comp like Eatonswill just to stick you in a £23,000 a year school like Westminster the minute I've become Prime Minister. Send me to a comp down here, then. I don't think you'd like it. Try me. There's a lot wrong with some of our inner-city schools. And it's something we do intend to start addressing during the course of the next Parliament. If they're good enough for other folks, kids, why aren't they good enough for me? I have discussed this with a number of people including the Chancellor of the Exchequer and the Home Secretary, because I know it's important to you. The nearest state school is Jericho Road. It's the kind of school that nobody sends their kids to if they can help it. They never have anywhere near enough staff, never mind the right sort. They have children from over 25 different nationalities and no proper resources to deal with it. It's the kind of school that shouldn't exist. And I hope in a few years' time it won't. Send me there. If you're going to change it, put your money where your mouth is. Oh, no, Rose. No. <laughs> no!